welcome back to my channel all right this video reading is who's spreading lies about you uh, what are they saying and why are they saying it and if we can find out where they're spreading these lies where are they saying it we'll get that too all right so if you're brand, brand new hit the sub button as well as the bell notification I drop videos weekly also to all of you who keep me booked and busy and who have been referring me out to folks I am so very grateful for you all thank you uh, if you'd like to book a private reading, coaching, same day read, walk and read, priority reading, check the pinned comment below as well as the description box below. Um, if you'd like to become a patron of mine, uh, the link for that is in the description box below as well as the pinned comment below also. And go follow my second channel, y'all. Go ahead, follow my second channel. Uh, the link for that is in the pinned comment below as well as the description box below. Also, I have membership open at the time of me doing this reading. This is a timeless read. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be open in the future on uh, on the YouTube, but I'm testing out uh, the celebrity readings tier. Um, and the benefits are the same as those for the patrons. So go test that out. Or, well, yeah, go test that out. Go see if you want to, you know, become a member. And, yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Um, yeah, and that's it. <laughs> so let's get to this reading. All right, so you got three decks to choose from. This is going to be deck number one, deck number two deck number three again deck number one deck number two deck number three see which of these decks you feel resonate with you the most and then i want you to come back when you're ready for your answer all right so let's find out so universe thank you for the channel messages who's been telling lies who's been spreading lies about those who chose option number one who's been spreading lies those who chose option number one. All right, we have the page of earth that came out in the reverse. This can be somebody that's younger than you with this page of earth, somebody that you're currently disconnected from, but this person wanted some type of, you know, stable connection with you and it failed. Um, I also feel like this person can be a Sagittarius. Looking at this upside down, this looks like that, you know, the center is bow, you know. Or that Sagittarian bow. We have the Two of Swords that came out in the reverse. So I feel like with the Two of Swords, this definitely feels like this can be somebody romantic um, or a friendship. It's something that didn't really go anywhere. So I feel like it was either premature or this person's a little bit, you know, premature as an age. Like they're younger than you. But it feels like a connection that was very premature. You know, it was you weren't vibing with it all in all. This person wasn't on your level, you know, whatever that was, whether it was mentally, emotionally, spiritually. And I feel like, you know, this person kind of took it away. They, they're in the feelings about it. So that's what's going on with that. You know, you decided not to... That's a really fool around with this person, whether it's a friendship or relationship, romantic universe who's spreading lies about those who just option number one. We have unexpected changes or the wild card in the reverse. Yeah, so this is somebody that you kind of like ghosted. You like just kind of cut the relationship off with this person. Um, and essentially you did that because, you know, yeah, this you honestly, you all, for those of you who picked option number one i'm not getting i'm not getting an explanation deeper than the fact that you and this person just weren't vibing anymore and you chose to cut it off so that's what that is so let's see so let's find out some more so why are they telling lies about you so we know who it is why are they telling lies about you option number one what's this person telling lies about them why is this person telling lies about them we have the world card in the reverse. Ooh, okay, I got my explanation already, but I want some more cards. Why is this person telling lies about option number one? We have the Knight of Swords, okay. <laughs> this is clear as day why they're telling lies about you. It's foolish too why they're telling lies about you. And then we have, yep. Yeah. Y'all, let me tell you about hate. Hate ain't nothing but secret love, okay? So this person is telling lies about you as a way to get your attention with the world's card in reverse. They're not done with you. They're not done, you know, they weren't done with you, though you're done with them. And what they don't realize is this ain't gonna do nothing but keep them even further from you. You know, like, you really, if you didn't want nothing to do with them, then you really don't want nothing to do with them now. 
um they're not done with you also with the ace um with the knight of swords in the reverse the two of you aren't talking you don't have any type of you know connection whatsoever you know i'm not getting that you all are in contact you know via social nothing y'all have no type of contact and then look this king of cups definitely solidified it for me they still got feelings for you they still definitely want this connection rather than once again this is either a friendship that, that that didn't get to grow or it's a romantic situation that didn't get to grow they're mad because they're not done they weren't done but you're done and they can't figure out why you weren't vibing with them that's the thing and here's the deal too you don't have to have a reason not to vibe with somebody you just don't vibe you just that's it you know, but this person, you know, wants in into your life. So that's what I'm getting with that one. So they're telling rumors and lies because they're not done with you yet. This is a, you know, and it's like they, they're, they're hoping that you kind of, you know, hear it, that you kind of feel the energy. So I do feel like there's mutual people around, you know, mutual people involved between the two of you all. But yeah, there's still a lot of, you know, they still got love for you and they don't know how to express that. So it's like, okay, well, how about I just, you know, maybe if I say this, this, that, and the other, they'll catch on to it. So let's find out what they're saying. What are they saying? Universe, what is this person? Those who chose option number one, what is that person saying to others about option number one? What are these lies? The hanged man and the reverse, of course, classic. What is this person saying about option number one? What are the lies that they're saying about option number one? We have the nine of pentacles in the upright. Classic, classic, classic. What's this person saying about option number one? We have the Ace of Earth in the upright. And then we have the Strength card in the reverse. So they're essentially putting everything on you. That's what they're doing. They're saying something about you being needy with this hangman in the reverse. Something about you being needy. Something about you, you know, um, somewhat kind of being a follower. Someone, something about you, you know, like... Like, you know, kind of being like, you know, needing a lot of validation, being a slave to, I'm hearing, I don't know why I'm hearing slave to the rhythm, not the Michael Jackson song, but kind of like, you know, being influenced by, you know, others, you know, following along, not really having a mind of your own with this hangman in reverse. So they're kind of saying like, you know, well, the reason why, you know, I stopped talking to them. So essentially, so one of the lies that they kind of cut you off and I feel like, you know, they're saying this to like family, friends, you know, once again, not like, you know, I'm not getting like no red, no widespread, like blasting off, but essentially, because the, here's the thing, they told a lot of people about y'all too. They jumped the gun with this one. So they're essentially telling people, you know, they were very needy, very clingy, you know, very mindless, you know, they were just kind of, mm, you know, spacey to themselves with this nine of pentacles, you know, um, emotional, um, with this nine of pentacles in the upright, yama yeah, you know. Um, I feel like for some of you, this person is, you know, like you met this person in a spiritual setting. This could be, you know, spiritualism in regards to the divination arts. This could be spiritualism in regards to whatever religion or, um, you know, whatever belief system that you have. But essentially, you know, telling people i feel like i don't know why i'm hearing this you all but i feel like people somebody somebody was telling you telling people like you know oh you know something about maybe you have the devil of demons or something like that something crazy for others of you um i feel like somebody has been spreading lies about you know about you being loose um so i'm getting that one um essentially you know that you don't have that you know that you need a lot of validation that you need a lot of people around you that you're very emotional that's what i'm getting with that one um we have the ace of earth or the ace of um pinnacles that came out i feel like even though this is in the upright i feel like they are talking about things in regards to your stability you know um not that you aren't stable but that you've got that you've garnered your stability through means of you know of what people have given to you you know so once again going back into being needy uh we have the strength card in the reverse i feel like definitely this person is you know kind of you know telling people you know just trying to told up like oh you know that person they're kind of weak you know they're weak i ain't got nothing to do with that you know they're weak that's what i'm getting with that one let's see and the world card was already out so let's see where are they telling these lies about you universe thank you for the channel messages 
So it's all pettiness. Y'all heard what came out. It's, it's pettiness. But where are they telling these lies about option number one universe? Ten of Earth. See, I told you, family. Anybody that's that's going to listen, family or friendships, where are they telling these lies about option number one? The Hermit card in the reverse. Social settings. I keep on getting the vision of like a dinner, you all. Like somebody telling somebody something over dinner. And then we have, what is that? Two of Wands in the upright. Um, anybody that's going to listen, if this is somebody who may, I feel like, and I definitely feel like you all, you know, kind of go around in the same circle. Because this is somebody who essentially, you know, is, will tell people in the future, you know, like, hey, you see that person over there, you know, like really trying to mess some stuff up. And then we have the death card in reverse. Yeah, this is somebody just spiteful. Where are they telling these lies about option number one? I knew it was going to come out. All right, so this fell out in the reverse, though. So I'm going to read it in the reverse. Uh, because I do feel like they are telling these things against social media, but not, once again, not blasting it out. So what I'm getting is like a blind item type of thing, you know, and, and, and I feel like this is important because you all run in the same circle. You and this person run in the same circle somehow, some way. So a blind item type of thing, um, like maybe in the DMs um, or they have DM'd about you or maybe in, you know, when folks be real petty, sending out those, you know, like what do you call it subtext type insta messages and stuff that's what i'm getting with that so let's pull some letters let's pull some letters and see if we can get some names who's spreading lies about option number one we have the letter I that came out. We have the letter O. We have the letter B. We have the letter T. Let's see, fat. We have the letter O. Your ex, boo. Somebody you ghosted, boo. We have the letter U. We have the letter T. We have the letter E. You have the letter E. For some of you, this could be, I'm getting like TT. This could be your auntie. Crazy, right? You have the letter U. Let me see. I'm get a couple more letters. For some of you, they can be jealous of your beauty. Letter T is really coming out. T and I. I told you, somebody's TT. Like your auntie. Somebody that, or somebody that's old enough to be an auntie. You know. That's what I'm getting with that one. Um... Tisha, T, E, Tisha, somebody name could be Tisha, somebody's name could start with an O, real strong, I'm picking up an O, but that's what I'm getting for you all, so you all let me know how you felt about this reading in the comment section below, please, does any of this ring a bell, um, yeah, go follow me on my second channel, Please and thank you. The link is in the pen comment below as well as the description box below as well as any private services, any private readings, my Patreon, all that good stuff. Check the pen comment below as well as the description box below and let's move on to our second option. Option number two. So universe, thank you for these channel messages. For those who chose option number two, who's been telling lies, spreading lies about option number two. Four of baskets in the upright. Who's been spreading lines about option number two? Oh, I already got the thing for this one. Somebody that you either have blocked or somebody that you're currently ignoring super hard. Who's been spreading lines about option number two? Five of coins in the, oh, come on, this is obvious. Somebody that you got blocked that's on the way, 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 way outside. And I can tell you right now, I feel like they're telling, this definitely feels like a romantic connection for some of you all, like very romantic for some of you all. Um, because I feel like the person that they're telling the lies to, or the people rather, is their friends. Like, you know, like, yeah, we did that. I had that. You know, all that, you know, craziness. Who's telling lies about option number two? 
supposed to be spreading the lies about option number two. Father of Bass. Dang, a lot of hurt feelings. This father of cups came out again. Father of Bass is in reverse. You might be dealing with a water sign. We have two things representing water. This person could be also be an earth sign. But um, essentially, somebody that, you know, this feels more more ro ro that. This feels more romantic than not. For some of you, this could actually be your father or a parental figure, your father, your mother, whomever. Um, this is either a parental figure or a figure or a romantic figure. Somebody that you have super blocked. They're on the out outside. And oh goodness, I'm not I haven't even pulled the rest of the cards on the rest of this. But they're telling lies essentially because they don't have access to you. They don't have access to you. They don't think this is going to get them access to you, but it's almost like, you know, this is their way of being close to you by talking about you in any way. And I know for some of you, it's like, why won't you say good things then? But th this person's feeling spiteful. They're in petty energy. Who's spreading lies about option number one? Seven of the, look, and then he even came out. Seven of knives. Seven of knives. Somebody who's very bitter right now. They're bitter about you not talking to them. Yeah, they're bitter about you not talking to them. And this is why they're spreading lies about you. Once again, this is an ex-lover or a parent that you are really not in contact with. So let's find out. Let's be a little nosy right quick. Why are you not talking to this person? Because they're bitter about you not talking to them. Ace of nines in the upright. Something about this person's energy feels very selfish. Look, I couldn't even get it out. Something about this person's energy feels very selfish, very draining. Six of Pentacles in the upright. Like this person, take, 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 take. They're very, and they're always being very slick with their words, slick with the tongue, you know, slick with their motives. Like this person has motives. It's never just, you know, an even relationship. You know, it's like you get, they can't just tell you the truth. So, yeah, so you got the heck out of Dodge. When I tell you, mother or knives, it's either your mother or your father, too. Somebody of an authority figure within your life, a parental figure, I should say, within your life, or a lover. Um, and essentially, you stop talking to them because this person, once again, you know, very negative, always, you know, just very draining, always negative with, with their words, you know, never seeing them. It's just it's a draining situation, very slick, always asking for something, always in your pockets. Yeah, you needed to get away. I don't blame you. Let's see. Why are they spreading lies about option number two? Why is this person spreading lies about option number two? Five of nines in the upright. Why is this person spreading lies about option number two? Ten of sticks in the reverse. The chariot. Okay, so what I can tell you is this person essentially wants to move on from this situation. That's that five of knives and that chariot in the upright. And it's definitely family. Somebody that you were romantic with or somebody, a parental figure, I'm telling you. They were spreading lies about you. Because essentially they want to move on from this, but they don't know how to drop the situation with that ten of sticks. Or they don't know how to drop the situation in a healthy manner. You've dropped the situation. You've moved on. You've very much so moved on. They don't know how to move on from this. And it's kind of, you know, like... It's hitting them in the head about it. You know, it's like, well, dang. That's what I'm getting with that one. So let's see. What are they saying about option number two? Behind their back. What are they saying about option number two? Father of sticks. Ace of baskets. Now, you want to know what's funny? For some of you, this person is saying, um, is is talking about how you get around a lot um, romantically. Um, I do feel like in the midst of the words that they're like, you know, the things that they're talking about. See, here's the thing. This one, option number two, is less about lies and it's more about bitterness. They're just talking about you a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Because there's a lot of love there, I'm seeing, with that Ace of Baskets. So it's less lies and it's more, you know, it's more bitterness that's, that's, that's really, like, you know, really pushing this. But for some of you, they are saying something about you get around a lot. I know that's weird. That's what's coming out, though. And then we have the Six of Sticks. Here's the deal. When they talk about you a lot, they're telling people how they don't really see you anymore. You know, kind of like, you know, oh, 
she, he just abandoned me, you know, like they just don't come around no more. They just don't mess with me, you know, like that type of thing. So it's a lot of bitterness. That's what that is. Like, oh, so they just think they're better than me, you know. They think they all that, that type of thing. So lies in a sense of not as detrimental of, you know, well, for those of you that this person's saying, you know, you get around a lot, that, that's, 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 you know, take that how you take it. But essentially like a lot of bitterness of like not ooh, here it goes this is somebody who isn't telling other people why you chose to stop associating with them and that's you know so it's not like they're the the lies that they're telling is more so admitting omitting the part that oh well, i did this to so and so and that's why they don't mess with me no more so that's what i'm getting with that one so let's see who are they saying these lies to yeah the justice card in the upright Who are they saying these lies to? The Emperor card in reverse. They could be talking to a Libra, an Aries, the Emperor in reverse. Six of Knives in reverse. Honestly, they're saying this to anybody that's going to listen. They're saying it to anybody that's going to listen. I feel like this person, this is somebody who a lot of people have a, just, a, you know... This person is like ten of baskets, family, anybody that's gonna listen. But I feel like this person is someone who um essentially has a very negative outlook about life and people around whoever comes in contact with them can see that, like, you know, like, yeah, you know, how the how about you look at the glass half full, you know, that type of thing. So let's see, let's where are they saying these lies about you? What is this person saying these lots of options? Yeah. Eight of baskets in reverse. Eight of coins in the upright. What I tell you? Anywhere people will listen. Some people are just telling their co-workers. Eight of coins in the upright. Where they work. Um, eight of baskets in reverse. I'm getting visions for whatever reason at the bus stop. Look, six of baskets in reverse. Friends. Even. You know, they're telling anybody with an ear. This feels like an older energy, too. So, I, for some of you, I really feel like this is a parental figure. Maybe even grandparents. Universe. Thank you for the channel messages. Where is this person telling lies about option number two? We have the glass ceiling or the tower. Yep, see, around. Around their building. Around, you know, whoever's going to listen. Look, the barista at the coffee shop. You know, the fool car. Anybody that's going to take an ear to whatever it is that they're saying this is what this is who they're talking to so essentially people that don't really know you so you ain't got much to know you know you don't have much to worry about there people who don't know you so let's get some names to see if their name pops out now for some of you this can be the parents of your person like if you're romantically involved with someone i'm getting it this can be the parents of someone that you're romantically involved with too So let's see, we have the letter R, we have the letter A, we have the letter N, we have X, we have O, we have S, yeah, XOXO, this is somebody who, you know, hugs and kisses, somebody that you're close to or were close to, T, we have the letter E, I mean, I'm sorry, we have the letter F, we have the letter Z, we have the letter V, we have the letter U, we have the letter O, we have the letter O. This person might like to run, or this person could run away a lot from responsibility. We have the letter I, this person sly as a fox, manipulative. I don't know why I'm hearing Nova, 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 like fashion Nova, I, I, E, this person could, I feel like here, Zara, this person could work at a retail shop, a clothing store or something like that, maybe further, maybe they love to shop at Fashion Nova, maybe they love to shop with Zara, we have O, and then we have the letter T. Let's see, so Tony, 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 Tony with an I, Tony with an I, E. That's what I'm getting with that. All right, so option number two, you all let me know if any of this resonated with any of you all. Um, 
And yeah, if you'd like to book up any of the private services listed in the intro, any private readings, join me on Patreon or go follow my second channel. Check out that pinned comment below as well as the description box below. And let's move on to our last deck, deck number three. All right, so universe, I thank you for the channel messages. For those who chose deck number three, who's spreading lies about deck number three? Magician card in the upright. This is a very manipulative person. Four of swords, and they're very calculated. This is like somebody who's like, you know, like the lion, lion in the grass waiting for the prey. Um, judgmental. We have the judgment card. This person could be judgmental, but somebody, I feel like somebody that has, um, they're over you in some capacity. This could be somebody that you work for, uh, somebody that you work with, but once again, they, they're over you in some capacity. Um, yeah, this is somebody that has some type of leverage over you. For some of you, this can even be like a landlord or something like that, but somebody who has some type of leverage over you. Um, for some of you, this could be a court case that I'm, you know, that you're fighting, that I'm getting energy on. Let's see. Who's spreading lines about option number three? Nine of wands in reverse. Essentially somebody that, somebody who's very insecure, but somebody that you, it's, it's like there's a defenselessness on your end. Somebody I feel like that, you know, for the time being, you might need them. This is interesting. Any more information? Who is this person that's spreading lies on option number three? Sun card. Somebody's very unhappy. This could be a fire sign. Something about work. This is somebody you, you, you've worked with. Hair font. Yeah, somebody who, who stands along. This could be a Virgo also. Let's see, give me more. World card in reverse. This is somebody who definitely has a vendetta against you. So, you know, wants some type of revenge. I'm hearing some type of, you know, work from home. Maybe you work, you know, at the same company with this person or something like that. But this is involved in work. Somebody's very being very manipulative, vindictive, and calculating behind the scenes. So let's see. Why is this person spreading lies about option number three or wanting to spread lies about option number three? Moon card in the reverse, Knight of Cups in the reverse. This person's hating on you. Seven of Cups in reverse. This person feels like you're a threat. And this is why they're spreading lies about you, straight up. This person feels like you're a threat. Now, I'm not getting any past friendship vibes or nothing, like straight up. I don't, yeah, no. This isn't somebody that you were once cool with, but this person feels like you are a threat. So it's like they're trying to stop you from advancing before you know you essentially ascend beyond them but here's the deal this person is going to be the cause we one we are always the cause of our own demise and this person is going to be the cause of their own demise trying to hate on you and trying to stop you what's for you is for you no man no person no woman no nothing can ever stop what's for you and this person needs to get that but yeah they feel like, you know, you're going to push them out of whatever spot that you're in. So they're trying to, you know, they're trying to stop you before that can happen. But, you know, spoiler alert, it's not going to happen to you. Um, universe, give me more messages. Why is this person telling lies about option number? Two of Wands, yeah, they're, they're being calculated. And look, strength card in the upright. Jealousy and pride. A lot of jealousy, a lot of pride. They feel like, you know, this is somebody at a distance from you, too. They're at a distance from you. So this is somebody trying to stop. This, this person just straight out of their mind. This is somebody trying to stop something about you from a distance, you know. This is somebody that needs to get out and around people, get a support system. But, yeah, that's essentially why they're telling the lies. So who are they saying these lies to? No, first we want to know what are they saying? What are they saying? about option number three what lines are they saying about option number three three of pentacles queen of swords something about you you gaining notoriety dishonestly 
uh, maybe paying for it or being hush hush about something, but something about you know you you gaining it you know or having the help from others you know gaining it you know whatever it is that that, that you've gained and I do feel like yeah mostly this is mostly surrounded work you did it dishonestly or you did it with the help of others or you know you didn't do it organically just pettiness six of swords you know you outsourced it. Um, whatever it is, you know, this is what they're saying. Like, oh, you know, they didn't really, you know, achieve what they achieved. You know, somebody else did it. They took the credit, that type of thing. Weird. Yeah. Somebody else took the credit. Full card in reverse. You know, they're not new to this. You know, they're lying about something. They're not as novice as they, you know, it, it, it just kind of like, you know, they're not as naive as they portray. They're not who they say they are. You know, like you're wearing some type of mask. Craziness. That's what I'm getting with that one. So let's see where or who are they saying this to who are they saying these last two who is this person saying these last two king of cups for some of you i'm hearing your followers so you it, you could be some you could be you know an influencer somebody with a large platform you're saying it to your followers five of cups who are they saying these things to maybe people that you know with the five of cups maybe people who are already you know see you as someone that they don't favor don't like knight of wands once again they're telling people it's like that i mean i don't know for whatever i'm hearing like blogs and stuff but it's not like a blog blog like it's like they're telling people prehand about you to stop things they're telling people who already dislike you to you know about you know you know about you in, in negative ways they're telling people who love you so this is somebody who's definitely blasting it to the masses like nine of pentacles they're telling it to everybody will of fortune in the reverse um i do feel like with this will of fortune in reverse page of cups ooh, um high priestess yeah this person might be going to the spiritual realm you know you know so be aware this person could also be telling you know whatever spiritual community this person could definitely be casting spells and stuff Ace of Swords in the reverse, Page of Cups in the reverse. This person, yeah, this person could be doing some type of, you know, rituals or something, casting some type of spell. So just protect your energy because this is somebody who's very spiteful. For whatever reason, they think that your success is going to stop theirs and this is why they're trying to stop you. So let's see, universe, where is this person spreading these lies? We have the hanged man that came out, the side hustler. So somebody who, yeah, works very hard um somebody who who you work with i keep on saying this look off the grid bottom of the deck insta famous you know off the grid bottom of the deck in the reverse so essentially somebody who is you know not within immediate reach of you but somebody that you work with and essentially somebody from a platform you know that you like you have a common platform like for some of you this is instagram like it's coming out strong that's what i'm getting with that one so let's see let's get some names of who this person is option number three universe let's play. We have the letter N, we have the letter R, we have the letter D, we have the letter N, we have the letter M, we have the letter I, we have the letter S. I'm not getting any names. We have the letter G, we have the letter O, we have the letter A, we have the letter N. I said T, right? We have the letter K, we have the letter U. Blank. This person is concealed in there, you know. We have the letter T. We have the letter P. Page. 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 Paging page. That's the one name that's coming out real strong for me. Page. 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 I don't know who Page is, but Page. Insta. Watch out for somebody on your Insta. Do we have the whole thing? I don't think we have the whole thing, but insta blank gram watch out for somebody on your instagram that's what i'm getting with that one um and yeah i'm not getting the other names but i hear page page or it could be p-a-g-e page 
Maybe this person is, you know, commenting things on your page, you know, on your social media platforms and, you know, under some type of, you know, disguise, but it's like really crazy. Who knows? That's what I'm getting with that one. So thank you all for tuning in. Let me know how you felt about this in the comment section below. Um, did this resonate for you? Do you know who this is? If you'd like to book any of the private readings or services that I've listed in the beginning or become a patron of mine or go join me on my second channel, um, check it out the pinned comment below as well as the description box below. And yes, you lovely people, you all go ahead. Let's, let's do a saging. Let's do a saging let's, so we can do a palette cleansing of the energy that you just took in here because it was not positive energy so before you leave i want to send you on your way in positivity and in love i pray you all have a beautiful day and you keep safe out there whenever you see this and whomever is spreading lies about you you know may whatever they say about you return right back to them you all keep safe out there peace and blessings beautiful people bye